Hello 3D printers and future owners of a 3D printing machine. My name is Humberto and today I'll be talking about how to install a glass bed on your Anet AA 3D printer in three simple steps. Coming right up. Welcome back. I know a lot of people, including myself, have been using blue painter's tape on the 3D prints. But I feel that when I use a glass bed, my first layer improves significantly because it gives an overall cleaner look because it's shiny and it's really, really smooth compared to the blue painter's tape. So, what are the steps to installing a glass bed? Step one. Clean the glass with water or alcohol and then apply hairspray and we're going to do that right now. So now that you have your glass bed, you want to use some rubbing alcohol, it's pretty simple. Just put a little bit on the napkin and clean it. it doesn't have to be perfect, just give it a nice clean. You can clean the other side if you want to as well. Once you clean it, leave it to dry for a few seconds or just use the other side of the napkin to close uh, use the other side of the napkin to dry it out. Now that it's dry, apply some hairspray. Any hairspray works. This one I'm using, I found it really cheap on the store. And just leave it to dry for a couple minutes. Step two, find the thickness of your glass. This one is three millimeters thick. So on my printer, I will increase the Z axis stopper three millimeters higher. That way on the next print, when I select the option of home all, the extruder will go down and it will not crush into the glass because we increase the height three millimeters on the Z axis stopper. Step three, now that your glass bed is ready, we have to place it on the 3D printer and clamp it and I'll show you that right now. So this is the Anet A 3D printer that I'm using and I'm going to place my glass which should have finished drying up by now on the platform like so and to tie it I'm gonna use some binder clips on the sides and it's ready to go. Now one last thing before starting the print level it up, you know the drill, you go to home all and then you can adjust it really simple and it even has space right here for the screw for the screwdriver. Once your print is complete leave it to cool down all the way to room temperature otherwise you, you will not be able to remove the print because it will be rock solid stuck on the platform but once it cools down it will fall off right away. Now that you have your glass on your 3D printer ready to go you have to adjust some settings on your slicing program so what I use is 65 degrees celsius because the glass is not going to be entirely 65 since there is the metal platform underneath so I don't have a thermometer with me but I assume that the temperature of the glass is slightly lower than 65 so like 63 or 62 degrees maybe even 60 so that's a really good temperature to use with PLA so I keep my settings at 190 degrees Celsius for PLA these are the three simple steps for installing a glass bed on your Anet AA 3D printer. Now I got my glass bed for about one dollar on the local hardware store. So go and check your local stores out. If you found my video helpful, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. And let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you.